Hurricanes, tropical storms, and even severe thunderstorms can produce tremendous amounts of rain, which can cause streets to flood and overwhelm the city's drainage infrastructure. The city of Weston is constantly monitoring approaching weather events and has plans in place to manage stormwater flooding. Days of exceptional rainfall can produce higher than normal lake levels. If rainfall into the system exceeds what can be immediately removed, the lakes were designed to hold excess water until it can be pumped out. In addition to the lakes, roadways and swales are a part of the excess water retention system. Lakes throughout each community are owned and maintained by the city and divided into two separate basins, Indian Trace and Bonaventure. The lakes are part of an overall drainage system and were built to accommodate and store excess rainwater. Therefore, at times, lake levels will rise when rainwater from communities drain into the lakes. It takes time to lower the level of our city's lakes and waterways. The city operates its stormwater pumps under regulations from the South Florida Water Management District and other agencies. The Indian Trace Basin is permitted to pump out up to 350 million gallons per day and the Bonaventure Basin 160 million gallons per day. The lakes in the Indian Trace Basin are interconnected and its water flows by gravity south toward the pump stations located near the C-11 Canal alongside Griffin Road. The lakes in the Bonaventure Basin are interconnected and its water flows in a northerly direction to the pump stations located close to the New River Canal near State Road 84. The pump stations in both basins are operational every day of the year. They discharge water into each of these canals and the water is then directed west to the Everglades. These same primary canals also have to accommodate rainwater flows from all the communities to the east that are adjacent to each canal. Drainage systems within private communities are the responsibility of the homeowner association. It's important that HOAs and residents do their part in helping to reduce street flooding by keeping storm drains and catch basins clear of debris, such as leaves, palm fronds, and other landscaping waste. Because rainwater ends up in the Everglades, minimize the use of fertilizers and prevent oil, grease, and other toxic chemicals from entering the storm drains. Also, it's important to pick up any pet waste. This will help in protecting the Everglades' fragile environment. The City of Weston is committed to reducing stormwater flooding by monitoring weather, operating and maintaining equipment at our pump stations, and overall maintenance to the city's drainage infrastructure. The City of Weston communicates with residents through various media. Ensure you are aware and informed. Visit us online at westonfl.org.